Today I'm going to be opening two Pipsticks packs. These are both the June packs. The reason I'm opening two is because I sent the kids pack by accident. So I thought I may as well open it and share it with you guys because I haven't shared this on here before. I know there's a lot of people who watch me who are parents. So this might appeal for you if you want to get something for your child. The prices of both the packs are the same. There is a $14.95 one and a $9.95 one. Obviously the more expensive one has more in it. I'm going to start with the kids pack. So we have a little raffle ticket, which is something that's in every Pipsticks pack. There's a colouring sheet, and what does this say? So this is kind of like a mini information sheet, and there is obviously a different raffle for the kids than there is for the pro subscribers. So this says June's prize is a glow-in-the-dark journal and stickers. Then it has May's winning ticket number, and then it has some information about the printables that Pipsticks offer. There's then a couple of sheets of coloured paper. So I suppose you can obviously use the stickers straight away onto some paper, so your kids don't end up sticking stickers anywhere and everywhere. <laughs> and then these are the stickers. So we have some tiny little robots, which are the kind of raised stickers. There's a little sheet of planets. There is some rockets and spaceships and stuff. There's a big robot sticker. There is some kind of reward stickers. So you've got out of this world, blast off, way to go. And then we have a big sheet of bees, which seem to be doing various different things. So that is everything that's in the kids pack. I have a feeling this would be the 995 one just because there's not as many sticker sheets in here so yeah i'll leave a link below to the kids pack if you want to have a look i'm now going to open this one which i am super excited about because it's a collaboration with amy tangerine i've seen sneak peeks and stuff on amy's instagram and on the pipsticks instagram and i am just pretty excited for it first of all can we just appreciate the envelope because that is so pretty in itself so we have my raffle ticket there's all the stickers which i'll go through in a minute we have the pipsticks postcard we then have the card which keeps everything flat and this has a load of like travel stamps on which is really cool and on this side which my camera does not like <laughs> because it is white it basically says let the adventure begin and then this is the info sheet which is such a nice print the same as the envelopes I keep the info sheets and reuse the paper I don't think I've got it in this journal but this is what I use them for a lot of the time in my creative journals I don't use the cover as pages and also the back and the front page I don't really use either I use this page to put pockets on for spare photos and this is where I use these papers from Pipsticks. This one's not from Pipsticks. This was just some fun wrapping paper that I had and I wanted to use. I think it was from a paper gang box actually. So yeah, I basically use these to cover like the back and front of my creative journals. I don't like leaving them blank and because this is kind of shiny paper it's harder to write on. So I don't tend to use it in the background of journaling pages that I know I'm going to write on. So here I've used some paper which I've written over but that's not glossy so I can write on it whereas this one would be harder to write on. So I tend to use these to cover things. I might even use this to cover one of the inserts, like planar inserts that I have. Paper is the perfect size for covering the cover of a regular sized insert. You have plenty of paper to cover the whole back and front of it. So that's what I tend to use these papers for after I'm done with them. But yeah, inside as usual there is the raffle prize. Um, so this is what this ticket's for. The winning raffle ticket from last month is down the bottom and I don't know where mine is. I think it's in a box on my shelf. I'll have to find it and I'll insert on the screen <laughs> whether it was a match or not but I'm pretty sure it wasn't. But yeah, also on here there is information about the collaboration with Amy. There's some information about their sticker shop and also there's a new printables club. So for $4.95 per month, you get a load of printables. That's something new on the Pipsticks website. So I'll leave that link below as well if you want to have a look. And then in the middle here, we've got a July sneak peek, which is a load of fish stickers. We now get onto the stickers, which I'm so excited for. So the first one is this one and it's the word summer with a love heart and it's in Amy's writing. If you haven't heard of Amy Tangerine before, then you must be really new to my channel because I use a lot of her stuff in my crafty videos. But she is a designer of crafty products and she does the most amazing hand lettering. She does have a YouTube channel as well, which I'll leave linked below if you're interested. And she shares a lot more of her hand lettering and stuff on there. We have a little sheet of lemons and they've all got little faces on, which is really cute. There's a little sheet of rainbow hearts. And again, these are in that kind of raised epoxy style. We've got the days of the week written on the kind of spotty background and each of these are in a little rectangle and then down the side there's a load of little triangles and again like the summer sticker these have been written by Amy. There's a whole sheet of makeup stickers so you have little nail varnishes, lipsticks, there's some sunglasses, a mirror, a little eyeshadow palette, basically a whole range of makeup on there. There's a little sheet of aeroplane
airplanes. We then have this sheet which has a load of snacks on. There is this sheet which has ice creams and ice lollies on. We then have a sheet by Violet Stickers. So if you saw my last video you would have seen the amazing stickers she designed which were like feathers and like cameras and stuff. This sheet has a load of tropical flowers and plants and stuff on it. And then we have this one which is also designed by her and it has a load of watermelon, pineapples and there's also a flamingo and a cactus on it. We then have this sheet which is a load of paint splodges. We have this sheet which has kind of like washi strips on and then there's a strip of houses and some little cars. We then have this big sheet which has a load of different like succulents, there's cactuses, there's little terrariums and they all have tiny little faces on which is adorable. There is a sheet of leaves and these ones are rose gold and they are glittery. And last of all we have these stickers which again has Amy's writing on and of course they have been made by Pipsticks so every single bit of space on this sheet has been made into a sticker which is definitely definitely something I love about the Pipsticks own stickers. So this was everything that came in the June Pipsticks pack. I'll have a load of information and links and stuff in the description and I will also have some conversions from US dollars to pounds in there as well. This is a US based company but they do ship to the UK and the shipping is very reasonable. But yeah, I am really happy with this month's pack. I love that they've collaborated with Amy and I definitely think they should do more collaborations in the future. If you have any questions then let me know below and I will get back to you. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.